Jacopo Vitale, a researcher in uh, sports science and uh, sleep uh, behavior. And uh, my home institution is the Galeazzi Orthopedic Institute. Um, when we are talking about sleep and sport, we have to pay attention about these two variables since the sleep behavior can influence the, our physical activity and the physical activity can influence our sleep behavior. So for example, when you sleep well, when you have uh, the right amount and quality of sleep, you can uh, also have a good performance, a good physical performance and that is the same also for athletes, but at the opposite. So, and then when, uh, and also the physical performance can influence your sleep. For example, if you perform high intensity physical performance, physical task late in the evening, this could negatively influence your sleep behavior. And uh, similar, but on the opposite side, if you perform moderate intensity physical activity, that would promote, uh, help uh, your sleep behavior. That's why a lot of people used to do moderate intensity training in opposite with the high intensity training. Uh, also, a final point, key point really important, is the chronotype of the athletes, because some athletes are morning type, other athletes are evening type. So coaches has to pay really attention when they schedule their training, because some athletes would like to perform better in the first part of the day in the morning while others in the evening so we have to really pay attention and study both the chronotype sleep chronobiology and the physical activity